All right. Welcome back. Thank you so much for joining us. You can hit that likes button. You can hit that subscribe button. But thank you so much for joining us. You could be watching any YouTube video, but you are watching this video right here. So thank you so much, as always, for your time. Um, let's get right down to it. It's the fourth quarter, and uh, I'm going to set this up really quick in, in what's been going on. So what's been going on um, here in this game, coming into this game, we're uh, four and three and seven. Sorry, we're three and seven, and potentially has to have a chance to go four and seven against the seven and three Jacksonville Jaguars. They're one of the tougher teams so far in this particular season. Um, this game been neck to neck, uh, pretty much the whole game. It's DeAndre Swift runs another first down off of a first down play. That that's what we need to be able to 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 win this game. Um, so hopefully, uh, this will continue along the way. But in the meantime, while you know, with this game being a neck to neck, uh, halftime Jacksonville came back to tie the game. And then in the third quarter is when everything just broke loose. Um, DeAndre Swift ran a big game to get into uh, the red zone off of our own end zone there and uh, pretty much scored the touchdown. And that was pretty much him on that entire drive. And then we stopped Jacksonville and got another touchdown out of that. And then Jacksonville scored three points to. Uh, make the score now 34 to 45 Detroit. So we uh, need to win this game to at least gain some sort of momentum. Um, it's possible that we may not make the playoffs, but I would like to at least give it a shot considering that how this season has just went into hell uh, for us. Um, I've been throwing more interceptions than I have touchdowns. So it's just been one of those crazy hectic seasons that, you know, as a third year player, it's like this is unacceptable and I need to do better. So, so far, I have not thrown any picks and I believe I've thrown, I believe at this point, four touchdowns. Here we go. Scrambling out of the pocket. And there you go. The one time run you will ever see me run. It was the seam open. I had to take it. Get take what the defense gives to you. They contain Christian Kirk. I'm like, you contain Christian Kirk. You're not going to contain my feet. You're not going to contain my legs. Now, granted, I ain't a very fast runner, but I can get you something. So it's now second, I think that's second down and one. So that would be, you know, a very good scenario to set up for another first down. My job is just to be able to get that first down marker piece by piece. And here we go. Boom, first down. Gotta be very strategic when you're playing these games, especially man. Any game, hit that. Any game, so that's what we're looking like right now. We're looking pretty good. We're looking pretty good to to extend this lead and to be able to, oh, uh, potentially win this game. Now it's just all about time management. It was like that in the third quarter, but DeAndre Swift was just like, "I got other plans. I I, I need these yards." I I need to show them something. I need to show them that I'm just as much as a threat as anything. I'm really trying to get him the X factor uh, uh, capability, but that that has, that blah that has not happened yet. That hasn't happened yet, and I'm hoping that it will at some point because this boy just been a monster. Another handoff play. Had a scene to the left there opening, um, but probably didn't see it. I think that was Salvador Ahmed, too. I don't think that was DeAndre Swift that time. See, this is a critical game for Jacksonville because I'm not sure what the AFC South look like at this point, but I know that the Colts are 5-5, five and five, so this is very much a critical game for them, too. TJ Hawkinson with his catch. I threw it into to coverage there, and that was a very, that was really actually a bad throw, but uh, he still caught it. So I'll take that and run with it. But you know, you want to try to avoid those as much as you can, because them could be costly interceptions. They could be costly injuries. You just want to try to prevent that the best way you can. All right, here we go. Another first down play. First down and ten. Time management. Another hand out DeAndre Swift for losses. I believe it's two. Uh, yes, for a loss of two yards, second down and 12. 
I'm sorry, second down and 13 is actually a three yard loss. Great. So now, how do you capitalize off of that? That was cover one. That was a blitz. So how do you how do you respond to that? Well, to me, I'm going to throw this ball. That's how I'm going to respond to it. Like I haven't been able to stop my arm all game. Why not? Run out of the pocket. Boom. Wide open. Touchdown. And that's not Christian Kirk. Oh, no, that's not a touchdown. It's a first down. First down and goal. Sorry. It's all right. It, it, it's in the red zone. We're good. Scrambling out of the pocket. Um, I'm not. I, I, I don't like that. I, I could be an improviser. Uh, be able to buy time to, to get players open, to be able to get that ball out. It's the most important thing to me. That's what that is. Just being able to do that. So here we are, first and goal. Got another chance to really extend this lead with 7.03 left in the fourth quarter. Let's see what happens. DeAndre Swift, straight up the middle for a touchdown. So now we just extended this lead, and, and hopefully that we can go ahead and win this game. Now, uh, I don't take these games for granted because when Kansas City – when we played against Kansas City in the Super Bowl, we was up this much. And Kansas City came back, and they only lost by one, and it was all in the fourth quarter. So I don't ever take these games for granted. Even though Jacksonville did not score, I'm not taking this for granted. We're going to continue to work until that clock is up. Until it says 0, zero, zero. And now they want to be aggressive with the ball to be able to fumble the football to get the ball back to them. So now you got to really be careful, not only with time management, but being able to make sure that you maintain your blisses and get those wide open spots. Second down and eight. Another hand out to DeAndre Swift. Wide open look. There you go. Another first down. That's what we needed all game long to be able for him to be able to get going in the running game and everything else will come into play. First down and 10. Contain your blitzes as always. Another handoff. Look like probably got about five or six yards out of that. Got five yards out of that. Second down and five. Time management. And they had a play where they was going to contain everything at this point it's all about running the ball for me maybe a little smash mouth football on behalf of throwing it but going to continue with the smash mouth football on the ground as DeAndre Swift gets another first down mm. another blitz now that was a blitz and still could not contain it that's the most important thing is to be able to have your you have to have you know, very good offensive lineman that I offer some line that can contain these type of blisses, be able to handle, you know, being that bridge. Oh, I'm sorry, not bridge, but gate. Wide open. Touchdown. It's being bold. Being bold. Fifth touchdown on the day. No picks. Team went to run out of the pocket, almost got sacked. But, you know, everything goes on that behalf. But you got to take those risks. You got to be able to buy time. You got to be an improviser. Rather, if you are improviser and not as your uh, key player, you got to be able to improvise. But we end up winning that game. Congratulations. We're now 4-7 and seven on the year with Jacksonville at 7-4. and four. Um, This is great. Um uh, we we'll catch the next game and see what happens from there and see if we can make this playoff run, late playoff run anyway, and see if we can try to get in there and sneak in there into the sixth spot. But, again, thank you for watching. Um, yeah, thank, thanks for watching. I, I just get uh, I'm just really speechless for, for you guys coming on to, to watch. So thank you so much for watching, and thank you so much for your time and, and paying attention and just enjoying our content. At 369 yards and five touchdowns. Uh, so, again, thank you so much for watching.
And as always, catch up with us for more YouTube content. But until then, ciao.